Did anybody notice that after they went to image map stuff and they click save and you clicked get your code and you went to your HTML code that it said warning I cannot host images on my server. Did anyone read that? No. What that means is is there right now imagemaps.com has your picture on it. When you put something on the internet it has to be hosted on a server. So when you put your header to Blogger, it's hosted on Blogger's server. But right now, Blogger code is reading that it's on image maps, but we need to get it on Blogger's. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So you're going to open up your blogs, and you're going to go to something called Pages. So on your dashboard, you're going to click Pages. I'm going to delete this because I am going to show you how to do it right now. We want to do a new page. And what a page is, is just like a post, except you don't see it unless you choose to see it. So I'm going to do a blank page, and I'm going to call it Images. And I'm calling it Images because this is where we're going to store different images that we need to use. And it'll be easy to know that that's an image. So remember, you're going to insert the image, you're going to choose your header. Make sure it's the right one. You have to add it, like make sure it's blue to add it. And there it is. And then you're going to publish. Then what's going to happen is you're going to go ahead and you're going to click view. So it looks just like a post on like a on your blog but it's not there's no way to get to this unless you are logged into your dashboard so when you click on here don't get confused don't click here cuz this is the one that's on image maps but if we click here we get the picture and right up here it has a html url but if we right click and select view image if everybody looks up at the url address it changes. So this is where Blogspot is storing this picture, this long gobbledygook, but I know it's a picture because it says what I named it and dot gif. Does that make sense? You're gonna copy that because it's all highlighted and we're just gonna keep that copied. Then we're gonna go back to your layout. We're going to go back to your script. Now I already changed this one so it's going to look a little bit different but all that matters is you're looking for the three letters SRC and then it says equals and there's quotes. You want to copy and paste sorry not copy you just want to paste your link into the quotes where it says SRC equals quote you're gonna paste your link into to the next quote so you gotta highlight from quote to quote to make sure you're getting it don't delete the quote don't delete use map because that's what's actually mapping the header you can go ahead and click save so does any can anyone guess what SRC stands for source. So where is the source of the image coming from? And then I'm going to view my blog. So it's up here, so that's good. And awesome, my links are not working. That one is. We're good. Oh, they were working. Blogger went to blogger. Just kidding. We're good.